हेलो व्यूवर्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन इम्पॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्चुअल लिमिट राइट सो हियर वी हैव टू इवेल्युएट दिस लिमिट दैट इज लिमिट एक्स टेंस टू जीरो एक्स ओवर वन प्लस सिग्नम ऑफ एक्स नाउ हियर वी सी दैट द फंक्शन इन्वॉल्व सिग्नम फंक्शन राइट सो बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग फर्दर लेट एस फर्स्ट सी द डेफिनेशन ऑफ सिग्नम फंक्शन राइट सो वी नो दैट सिग्नम ऑफ एक्स इज डिफाइंड लाइक दिस राइट सो सिग्नम ऑफ एक्स विल टेक प्लस वन वैल्यू फॉर ऑल वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स विच आर ग्रेटर दैन जीरो राइट एंड सिग्नम ऑफ एक्स टेक्स द वैल्यू जीरो वेन एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड सिग्नम ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन वेन एवर एक्स इज लेस देन जीरो राइट so this is the definition of signum function and we are going to utilize this definition uh, for the evaluation of uh, this limit right now uh, let us uh, first take f of x is equal to x over 1 plus signum of x right so now uh, let us take this limit as l and l is equal to limit x tends to 0 and f of x right now uh, from uh, differential calculus uh, we know that a limit uh, is said to exist if the right hand limit exist and the left hand limit exist and both the limits are equal right so uh, this limit at x is uh, equal to 0 is said to exist when the right hand limit and the left hand limit both the limits exist and they are finite and they are equal then we say that this limit exist right so what we will do uh, we will first find the uh, right hand limit of this function then we'll uh, find the left hand limit of the uh, function and then uh, we'll analyze uh, whether right hand limit exist or left hand limit exist or both the limits exist or they are equal right so let us uh, first find the uh, right hand limit right so uh, right hand limit is denoted by rhl and we can uh, use this notation that is x tends to 0 plus right and f of x so uh, this is the notation for uh, right hand limit and here uh, we'll take x is equal to 0 plus h where h is a very small quantity it is finite quantity and greater than 0 right so when x tends to 0 obviously h tends to 0 right so now this right hand limit uh, this limit is in the form of h is given by limit h tends to 0 and we have f of for x we can write 0 plus h right so we have limit h tends to 0 and we have f of h right so now uh, from uh, this function we can write the value of f of h so this is limit h tends to 0 and f of h is h over 1 plus sigma of h right so we'll replace uh, here uh, h for x right okay so now here we see that we have signum of h right and signum of h uh, is equal to 1 why because see h is greater than 0 and h is a positive quantity and for all positive x that is x greater than 0 signum of x takes the value plus 1 right so signum of h is equal to 1 Uh, due to this definition because h is greater than 0 or we can say h is a positive and finite quantity right so here we'll take signum of h is equal to 1 so now this limit is limit h tends to 0 we have h over 1 plus 1 because signum of h is 1 and this is limit h tends to 0 h over 2 right now Uh, we can take h is equal to 0 here so we have 0 over 2 that is equal to 0 right so the right hand limit of this function 
when x tends to 0 is equal to 0 right so here we can write uh, rhl is equal to 0 now let us find the uh, left hand limit now the uh, notation for the left hand limit is limit x tends to 0 minus and here we have f of x right so now we can write x is equal to 0 minus h where h is again a positive quantity and it is uh, finite and when x tends to 0 obviously h tends to 0 right so now here we can replace x by uh, 0 minus h so now uh, the left hand limit is equal to limit h tends to 0 and we have f of 0 minus h and this is limit h tends to 0 we have f of minus h right and f of minus h uh, can be obtained from this function by replacing uh, x by minus h right so we have limit h tends to 0 here we have minus h 1 plus signum of minus h right okay now as we have seen earlier that signum of h takes value plus 1 because h was greater than 0 and here uh, we have to find the value of uh, a signum of minus h right now see h is greater than 0 so minus h is less than 0 right so when uh, minus h is less than 0 uh, from this definition see when x is less than 0 signum of x takes the value minus 1 so signum of minus h is equal to uh, minus 1 right because minus h is less than 0 and for x less than 0 signum of x takes the value minus 1 so here we can substitute minus 1 so now we see that limit h tends to 0 we have minus h over 1 plus minus 1 right so now this is limit h tends to 0 we have minus h and 1 minus 1 is 0 right and we see that here we have 0 in the denominator and we see that uh, this right hand uh, this left hand limit it does not exist right it does not uh, exist does not exist right so the left hand limit does not exist because uh, uh, here we have 0 in the uh, denominator and uh, the uh, right hand limit is equal to 0 so we see that uh, the right hand limit is 0 but the left hand limit does not exist so both the limits are not going to be equal and hence uh, overall we conclude that the limit of this function f of x when x tends to 0 uh, it does not exist so this is how uh, we solve uh, this problem uh, using the concept of uh, signum function.